It's got an oil leak now though. Looks like it's coming from there. Just there. But this has got some crappy silicon gasket sealer type rubbish on it. So I'll buy a new gasket and fit that. I also notice there's a crack in the crank cover just there that's leaking oil. I don't know how I'll fix that, probably use solder. But we'll check that out. The first I'll do it while it's off, but the first thing I need to do is get a crankcase gasket. This is just some really like silicon jobby. There's a crack up there, which I've noticed. But you can see the oil dripping out from this gasket. I bought a gasket, so I'll drain the oil off first. Apparently, you need to warm the engine up first, which I've just done. And now I'll take the sump plug off. 17 mil. This is probably going to be hot oil. In close. Don't want to drop it in, otherwise I'll have to fish it out. Is there a washer on there? Yes. So we've got a bolt and a washer. There you go. There should be a litre of oil in this engine. But when I've checked the dipstick it does seem more than a litre. So I've got another jug just in case. Oh here we go. Is that coming to the end? Bike should be on its centre stand as level as possible, warm engine. Wow, there's some sludge on that. That's like grease. Like a sponge. if it's got a sponge cap on the end because that is weird oil looks black considering the bike hasn't been started since 2018 and the guy I bought it off apparently changed the magneto I don't know if he's changed the oil but that don't look like fresh oil to me why this is out I think I'll take the oil filter out as well. If I've got something big enough to take it off. going. I don't want to ruin the knot.
no, that's not loosening that, so I won't damage it till I get the proper spanner or something on it. The oil's drained, so now I need to remove this sprocket cover. And the crankcase cover, well not crankcase, flywheel. It's got some dodgy 10mm bolt on there. Take this cover off to see what's in. Might not need to, but it won't hurt. In fact, I'll loosen all of these nuts. It's probably best to do this in some form of star pattern so as not to put strain or bend. bar somewhere. They're all loose, so pause the video and take this off. I've taken all the bolts out, laid them out in the order they came off because some are bigger than others. So that's the starter motor, and then the bolts go in that way. Starter motor. There, there was a hidden bolt in there holding it on, that golden coloured one. But now, Looks like this might be coming off. I'm going to need two hands, so I'll pause the video and get back to you. You can see why it was leaking. This gasket's just a complete mess. I mean... Hello! That's not going to do anything. So now I need to clean all this off. The bits of old gasket. All of the bits of silicon sealer it looks like is used. Get it all nice and clean. You can see the timing marks on the flywheel. That's what sends the pulse. So there, to 
create the spark. That hole there is for the starter motor plug. I'll get this cleaned up and I'll be back. This side's clean enough now. So now I need to do the other side of the case and sort out that crack. Time to put the cover back on. I've given this a good cleaning out with a cloth and wiped all the oil and dirt out. I tried to fix the crack with the two-part bonding putty. It's been curing for about four days. Seems tough enough. If it doesn't work, I'll have to try something else. That's spotless to clean inside. I just need to fit the magneto and pickup coil in. I'll do that now. That's all back in. Now I need to fit the wires back into the plug. Blue, white, pink, yellow, black, red, green, white. That's that done. Now there's a little smear of oil to this face. This is the gasket that was on it. As you can see, that is just a complete wreck. Ripped. Stuck up with sealer. Busted holes. So I went on eBay. Ordered this 2.30 p.m. on a Friday and it was delivered 12.30 the following day. £4.85 that was including postage. vast difference. Yep, the same thickness. That was from Chinese motorcycle parts online, I think it is. CMPO, CMPO parts.com. Yeah, that was on eBay.